Hi guys, I'm now going to do a tutorial in Sony Vegas Pro 11. So, we're going to do a really, really smooth, nice motion track on Sony Vegas. So, first thing, you need a clip. I'm going to be using one that goes forward. What you want to do is you want to get, you go on to go to Mini Generators, Legacy, Text, click Default Text, pick a text. I'm going to use this and drag it out to the end of the clip. You see it's moving with it. Now what you want to do is make it this is just a pan and crop. If you want to make it side to side, you can use the track motion tool. So pretty much you want to see where it is on this. So it's about it's about at the spot of these two um block things. So right we're gonna get to the spot where we're right at them. Pretty much right here. Drag it in. Okay, so if I'm correct, that should look pretty nice. Hmm. Let me go to where I put the pan and crop and go to the next couple frames. Make it go past. And that should disappear there, which means I will drag that down and I'll I'm going to render it real quick. Okay, I just decided that I'm going to make it less good quality. So as you can see, it looks like it's not moving at all, and you're just going towards it. Okay, now here's for the good part that makes it look really nice. Let me just shorten the clip right here. Alright. So yeah, that looks really nice. Now, another part that you want to do, let's save that, uh, go to Video Effects. You need the new blue motion, uh, motion effects for this. And I think it's motion effects. Yeah, it should be. Uh, I have my own active camera. It's pretty nice active camera. Here's the settings if you want to copy those down. They're really nice settings and you put them on both the clip and the text and it should make it look like it, the text isn't moving at all but but the whole clip is let me render this alright I just rendered this and now I'm going to preview it it's kinda laggy but if you can see it you can kinda see the it moving. If you want to, you can change up the rate to like 60. I don't know, I'm just pulling around with this now. So let's put it at 60 and see how that looks. Draft. Let's do quarter. No, that's actually pretty good on half. Alright. See, that kind of looks better. But I kind of like it back at 44. Cause it's just like not a lot of movement, but it's enough for you to notice. And then yeah, so now let's put in some color correction. I'm gonna use Magic Bullet Looks. Um, you don't need it on the text unless you want to make that look kind of. Kind of weird. I I downloaded some presets from other people because I'm just too cheap to make my own. 
Let's use this one. Okay. I'm gonna put this on best half and render this. Kind of looks a little bad. Here, let me change this to black. This tutorial is kind of getting pretty long. So, oops. I guess I'll just end it right now. Well, I do not want the background color. Yeah, so that's plain black, and I'm not gonna pre fill it. I'm just gonna go through it like that. Boom. So, yep, that's the, tor the tutorial. Hope you guys enjoyed. Comment, rate, subscribe. Alright, thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.